and Braun of Granada Hills High. He may be a high pick in the June draft, but it'll take a whole bunch of money to keep this big hitting shortstop from turning down his college scholarship. Playing professionally is my ultimate goal. I mean, whether it happens now, I'm fortunate enough to have it happen now or, or three years in Miami. Uh, either way, it's just going to be an unbelievable experience, and I'm just excited about it. Got to keep working hard every day to try to achieve my goals. Neither option is something Ryan takes for granted. Last year at this time, he was nursing an arm injury, and he could only contribute as a designated hitter. Kind of, uh, kind of a wake-up call. Root awakening is definitely a frustrating injury, but uh, kind of did it open up my eyes to the situation that baseball may not be my future. And uh, if it isn't, I mean, it just I know how important my academics are, and that is why I focus and concentrate so much on that. Well, I think you're getting a first-class citizen, first-class person. Uh, he brings 100% uh, uh, to, the, to the field every time. He's an excellent student, carries a 3.8 plus GPA. Uh, I know he scored th about 13.60 on the SAT. I think they're getting a quality individual with him. I mean, I would not want to pitch him. He's, his hands are so fast, you cannot throw a good pitch him. That's why he's been walked so many times. He has uh, great speed and really good defensively, too. I think he's the best hitter actually in the state. I mean, his hitting is incredible. We come out here and hit like every single day in the backyard also. We have a cage. Uh, he's just the best hitter I've ever seen really in high school. He's just, every single ball he hits bombs every single time. That sounds like the whole package. But remember, this is high school baseball. Pro scouts will tell you that it's just about impossible to gauge whether a 17-year-old will reach the major leagues. In Braun's case, somebody will give him the chance to try. His dream is to, to, be, to make the major leagues. Uh, I think it's a realistic dream if he, if he continues to work hard at that and dedicate himself to, to his game. Ah, but with the occasional distraction. Ryan likes the girls. Yeah, it's good hanging out with him. You know what, I'm just enjoying every moment, you know, I'm just having a great time with it. I mean, sometimes I want to sit back and just, just take, just relax a little bit, you know, it gets, gets hectic at times, but uh, just enjoying it, just loving every minute of it. But in high school ball, even the best players pitch in on field maintenance. And Ryan gets no break at home from his folks. Definitely, they keep me on the feet, keep me on the ground. Still got to do all the little chores, everything like that. So I don't think that I'll ever stop. My parents have been extremely supportive. I couldn't ask for better parents or a better support system. They've just been unbelievable helping me throughout the whole thing. Ryan says math is his favorite subject. Not that he needs top marks in calculus and trigonometry to figure out the deeper meaning of a seven-figure signing bonus from a big league club. It's going to come down to a uh, financial decision. Um, I'm extremely excited about the prospect of going to the University of Miami. It's just going to be an unbelievable college experience at school with a great combination of uh, athletics and academics. So uh, either way, it's a win-win situation for me.